Fellas, I think I've got it. I think I've got the answer to everyone's problem. How do I get free Pokemon cards? And do I don't want to mow the lawn, I just want free Pokemon cards. I think I've discovered the way. So basically, here's the plot, right? The brand new Pokemon movie, Pokemon the 20th anniversary movie, just got released in Australia today. I'm going to the midnight, well not the midnight premiere, the one before that, because uh, apparently the kiddies can't stay awake till midnight, we have to go to like, I don't know, it's, it's a late sort of session. Anyway, going to that tonight, and I've heard rumours that with every ticket purchased, you get a free Pokemon card. Bah, a free Pokemon card. So all you have to do is convince your parents to go to the movies, and you should get a free Pokemon card in return. It should be that simple. So I'm putting it to the test. I'm gonna find out. I've got a bunch of my friends going as well. You know what? A bunch of 25 year old, 22 year old guys going along to see Pokemon. The coolest cats on a Saturday night. Like it does not get better. <laughs> it doesn't get better than this. So without further ado, let's head to the movies. Let's see if we can get this free Pokemon card. I'm so keen to suss it out. And uh, yeah, see what the movie's about as well. See if it's any good. So without further ado, let's head to the movies. Let's go, oh, gosh. like a camera into the cinema. Is it, a bit, it feels a bit dodgy, doesn't it? I feel like we're breaking the law, man, but we'll it's, be all right. We'll be all right. Uh, you know what? I think, I think we should be all right. I'm just telling my mum this to leave, and hopefully... Uh, yeah, actually, the main concern here is we actually get our Pokemon card, because if Andrew doesn't get it, you know, I'm going to have to lay down some Smackdown and get the Pokemon card. I think we should be right, though. How excited are you? You know nothing? Close to a little about this movie? I hope we can get a Celebi. That's all I want. A Celebi. I think this might... We'll find out. We'll find out. We'll get back to you on that one. Oh my gosh, we actually got the cards, boys. Literally, I couldn't, I couldn't film that because honestly, if you saw me taking a camera into the cinema, there'd be mad questions asked, but look what we got. Three Ashes Pikachu, all sealed promos, and all we had to do was go to the movies. I think that's a solid victory. All right, now let's actually watch this movie. I mean, I can't say that, you know, I'm, I'm more excited about the movie or the Pokemon card. It's about a draw at the moment. It's actually pretty good. Anyway, we'll unbox when we get home. But a pretty good success, yeah? Uh, that's, that's what I thought, car, that's yeah. what I thought. All right, let's uh, let's go watch this movie. I'm excited. All right, fellas, here we go. Just got out of the cinema. One word review from everyone. Corn dog, one word, review. Pokemon. Pokemon, Laurie? Well. 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 Well, you know, solid wow. There we go, that's not bad. So we've got Pokemon, a wow, and I'd probably give it a holy foot moly. There were too many generations in one film. That was actually crazy. But before we get run over, let's head back to the studio, unbox the Pokemon card. And uh, yeah, not a bad one. My Pikachu bad and bushy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry that was a terrible remix. But anyway, guys, this is the Pikachu. So he's like a real up close. I just got back from the movies and oh my gosh. It's so sick. And uh, if you haven't seen the movie, this actually makes a lot more sense. Like the attacks, the uh, like this Thunderbolt here. You're thinking, oh, it's a regular attack. Oh, honey, wait till you see the movie. And you'd be like, whoa, that thing is epic. Uh, then it's got the little feather there, which does mean something as well. I don't know how much I really want to talk about the movie, just because I don't want to spoil it for anyone that still has to go see it, because I think I did see it within the first week, so there's still a couple of weeks to go see it. Um, but yeah, really cool. It'll definitely links into everything. There's the I Choose You text right here. It's just a regular promo, though. No hollow up here, which is okay. Like, that's not the end of the world. That's completely fine. Promo number 108, does it say? Yeah, 108. That's pretty crazy. It's a Sun and Moon promo, too. So yeah, all up. Really cool rainbow background. Ashes Pikachu wearing the hat. And yeah, you're thinking, Endo, whoa, that's pretty cool. It comes in the bag as well with something else. So this one's right here. My friend actually gave me this one for you guys. So everyone thank uh, Lawrence in the comment section. But he's given away a uh, this one right here, which is pretty much, it just comes this and the Pokemon card. So inside, wearing the trainer's hat, you can get this Pikachu in Ultra Sun or Ultra Moon, which comes out this Friday, which I thought was so sick. So if anyone wants it, here we go. Tune into the video back on Friday and scan it. Be one of the first people to scan in the game, and it could be yours, the Pikachu. You're welcome, it's okay. But I thought that was sick. So not only do you get to see a movie, right? Not only do you get a flipping promo Pikachu wild card right here that you won't get anywhere else. This will be so much money. Try to leave it sealed if you can. Um, but if you really want the Pikachu, definitely not the end of the world. Just put it in like a sleeve or something. But you also get the Pikachu in the game. The best $12 I've ever spent in a movie ever. So, uh, yeah, absolutely fantastic. But then I thought, guys, we can't just do a video about me going to the movies. How about we do something else? I thought, you know what, let's open up this brand new Vulpix. It's a Nolan Vulpix uh, Pokemon Center exclusive box right here. Really sick looking box. I got it from Japan like a while ago. Never unboxed it on the channel. And I thought, you know what, today's the day. Let's make it a proper video, like as extreme awesome opening. Six boosters. These are all Crimson Invasion, what we're opening right now in English. A gold coin, promos, deck box, deck sleeves, 
Looks absolutely fantastic. There's the barcode. And yeah, without further ado, let's crack these open. I'm in love with these things. Look at the artwork. It's fantastic. But yeah, what is it? Rokon, Rokon's Crystal Season. Okay, I think that uh, that's the Japanese name for Vulpix, actually. But yeah, without further ado, let's crack it open. The good old Pokemon Center exclusive box. Let's do it. Dude, this is actually like super good value because I, I think I only paid like 29, 30 bucks for this one. So this is actually absolutely fantastic. Super happy with this purchase. Check it out. We get the uh, deck box right here. You know, the go-to sort of, it's not cardboard. It's kind of like plastic, um, more durable sort of plastic. So you can keep all your awesome cards in there. Bit of Velcro there. I'll keep it sealed just because I got a lot of these ones. And uh, yeah, nothing can hurt from keeping it sealed. Then we got this thing, which I reckon is so sick. A golden Alolan uh, Vulpix coin right here. Let's get out of its uh, packaging. Because this is one thing I definitely want to keep. It's a full, like, it actually has some weight to it too. Dude, that's actually crazy. What do you guys think? Look at that. Full gold and everything. Oh, that is so epic. I am so behind that. So a golden Alolan Vulpix uh, coin right there. Then, of course, we get the sleeves as well. So we got the, uh, yeah, Alolan normal. Really cutesy sort of sleeves. This whole sort of box is a really cutesy sort of vibe, right? Then, the promo cards. Let's, uh, I'll, I'll open this one for you guys. Because I think there's two cards in there. There must be. Normal and, uh, yeah, there is. Look at that. They've kind of bent, though, because that is getting, like, sort of hot in my room. And I reckon it must have bent these. Or maybe they'll bent because of the packaging. I'm not too sure. But it's okay, because look at this. All these leaves are all holographic leaves. So when it's, like, in the light, if we can sort of, there we go. If it's in the light, they just bounce up and down. Like, the light really just bounces off this one. God, it's crazy. Japan's already up to promo number 146. And we just were... Uh, English is only up to 108 with that uh, movie one right there. But then we got the Alola one right here. And look, the snowflakes do the same thing. They all reflect the uh, the light off them. Dude, this is sick. I so get around this. Awesome looking promo cards. But the real question is... I wonder what the pulls in the box are going to be. Because you know what? There's always, like for some reason, Japanese products just give like amazing pulls every single time. So, uh, yeah, let's crack this bad boy open, see what we can get. I mean, uh, we are doing the English set at the moment. We haven't got crazy good luck just yet, but this could turn around. This could be the uh, the turning point. Try and hopefully find a few cards that we can try and find in English. It's only a... Uh, oh, yeah, it's divided. Oh, dude, are you, what the flip? We just pulled this one in English, like the full art form. And then on the very first booster of Japan, we go and pull the... Uh, oh, my gosh, the flipping GX version. That's crazy. Oh my, dude, I told you, these Japanese boxes have the most insane pulls ever. Oh, they are so crazy on the very first booster. So typical. Like, in English, we have absolutely poopy luck, right? We go to Japan, boom, like, first booster pack, get a GX. And it's the GX of the, uh, the full-up form. Anyway, let's, uh, one from the back again. Can we do a back-to-back? -back? That would be actually pretty crazy. Got a big double here. All right. Only uh, five cards per booster pack, and then we get the regular rare uncommon. Because in Japan, you aren't even guaranteed a regular rare. In fact, I don't know if regular rares are even a thing in Japan. I think it just goes straight from uh, uncommon to holo card. Anyway, go one from the back once again. The last one of these uh, Silver Valleys. And let's go to Gold Town. Come on, let's do this thing. We're going to slend it, a core fish, and then the holo Gengar. That's one. I definitely remember this one in English. That's a pretty cool artwork, too. Kind of creepy, though. Could you imagine, you know, walking home and then seeing that in a side street? You'd be like, whoa, mama, gee whiz. It's Gengar. He's just doing his thing again. What an odd-looking Pokemon. Anyway, that's not a bad, like, three boosters. One Holo and one GX. Pretty good rates, for like, so far. Okay, Guzzlord. Show me the goods. If we could get a Guzzlord full art, that would be bananas. That thing looks sick. Especially in Japanese. That would be uh, actually pretty sick. The texture on that card's nuts, because it's like an all-black card. Alright, so we got Diggers V. Come on, just give me... Oh gosh, another holo card. Hydrogen this time. Pulled a couple of those ones in English. I definitely remember that. I think we got three or four of that one. Put that in the back, though. Definitely nothing to sneeze at. When holos aren't guaranteed, holos are always a plus. Second to last booster, though. I just... I think one more GX. If we can get one more GX, I'm writing it off as a major success right now. Alright, one from the back. Swing it around. Oh, we got Dwayne Johnson's, uh, you know, what was it called? A fanny pack. That's it. I was thinking about it. We got a uh, Magikarp. Hound. Oh, gosh, another uncommon. 
That's all right. That's cool. That's cool. The last boost pack of a Lolan Volpix. What do you guys think? Leave a comment in the comment section below right now. Do you think it's going to have the goods? Do you reckon we can get one more GX pull? But I really wouldn't be too fast right now. We have got the uh, two promos too. The two holo promos. All right. A Lolan Volpix. Step up your game right now, son. I believe in love. A Rangaroo. Let's go. For the boys. Pikachu for the squad. It's another flipping holo. This time a Reggie Ice. That is completely fine. How many holo cards do I have right now? And it's also pretty odd. Oh, that movie promo is not even a holo. It's just a regular rare. Um, yeah, that's actually a pretty sick array of cards we got right now. Look at this. This is all out of one box. One, two, three, four, five holo cards, and then one GX as well. That's actually crazy. That's a really, really good pull ratio. Then again, Japan always have crazy pull ratios. English is just that weird sort of set. They never get, like, anything too crazy. So we got that one. And then check this out. The I Choose You Ashes Pikachu hat. What a fantastic card. I'm so in love with that. Definitely leave a comment in the comment section below. Have you seen the movie? Have you got the card? Is it something you're going to do now? I think it's in cinemas the next couple of weeks, maybe? So, uh, yeah. Definitely Google it before you go. Give them a call. Make sure they have got the card because uh, no point in going if they haven't, you know? Might as well travel a bit more and get the card. But, uh, yeah. Have an absolutely fantastic day, guys. Make sure you enjoy the rest of the week. Most of all, going to keep on gaming. Alright, guys. Till next time. I'll see you then. So many pieces back together now. What's your vision?